A perfect story has an ordinary person confront an extraordinary challenge. After they give their all and win the day, they are reunited with the people they love and they lived happily ever after. This is the story God wants to tell with your life. This is the story we all deserve. Hi, we're Jerio and Lena, and we're so excited to be here with you today with our new kids series, Love Works. That's right, this time we're gonna be talking about how God creates love and how you can have more love in your life too. Today, we're gonna to be talking about our fairy tale endings. That's right, God has a design for your life. He wants to see you grow into a beautiful, loving person. Each one of us are born in the love of God. We grow in love through our brothers and sisters and our family, and one day we'll marry someone to share love eternally with. One day that love will blossom into children of our own. That's right, you'll have kids that you can teach about love, that you can share love with. And in this way, we continue a cycle of love, creating a world where everybody gets a happily ever after. In 1 John 4.19, it says, we love because he first loved us. So because God put his love into each of us, we can now share that love with others. God wants to share his love with all of us Unfortunately, this world has a lot of problems. We don't always feel love the way that God intended us to feel love. Many people have broken hearts and they break the hearts of others. Sometimes our families are not so complete and it's hard for us to understand the way God wants us to love. It all starts in the Garden of Eden. Adam and Eve disconnected from God. They weren't able to connect with his heart and their love was incomplete. They shared this incomplete love with one another and passed it on to their children. History is repeating this idea that love is incomplete, but God has a better story that he wants to share with us. That's right, God wants to bring love back in this world. And so he has been working with so many men and women to bring love back. As we realize again that we're God's beloved children, love can grow again and the world can be made new. But where does love begin? Love starts in the family. Father Moon once said, we are born in the bosom of the family and grow within the family. The family is our origin, our starting point, and our school of love. That's right. It's the school where we first learn how to love from our parents, our brothers and sisters. Then we reach out to our friends, our neighbors, our teachers. And it's really a time to grow our hearts and ourselves and then one day create her own family in the future. Brain break! Hey boys and girls, it's time for a game. We're gonna be launching love. Just get yourself a cup, a balloon, cut off the top and put it on the bottom of your cup, and launch your candy hearts. See how many you can get into the cups. Ready? Begin! Whoa! 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 Oh! Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> so you have your own friend. Sometimes it can be hard to show true love. Sometimes we want to sit in our feeling of being mad or hurt or sad, but we can take ownership of our feelings and become victors of love. We can be the heroes that bring love even in difficult situations and turn those frowns upside down. That's right. So this week, we want you to work on three things. Mm. First is to make a list of all the people in your life that love you people that listen to you, they tell you stories, they play with you, and just sit in that moment and feel it, and feel that love they're giving to you. Second, we want you to write down a list of ways you can show love to those people. Maybe it's writing them a card, telling them a story, helping with dishes, or just spending time together. This is ways that you can show your love to them. And third, or maybe first, is talk to God. Pray and thank him for the love in your life. 
and ask him how can you be a light of love onto others? As we relearn about God's design for love and the way he loves us, we can make this world a better place and create a fairy tale ending for the whole world. That's right, and starting with you. You are going to have your happily ever after, so start creating it now. It was so much fun learning with y'all. Can't wait to see you next time. Bye. Bye.